Europe is made richer because of these African athletes, the footballers at least in this article here, um, playing in Europe. I mean, they're not taking them because the looks or whatever. They're definite assets. But what has happened to Jean-Pierre uh, Adams and um, his other colleague, it's, a, it's kind of a, a reminder that something don't seem to be right in Europe. Now, Adams uh, had an injury, something minor, ended up in hospital, surgery, left uh, in, in a bad way, and ended up in a coma for the last uh, over 30 years. Uh, thanks to his devoted and loving wife, who is there by his side and helping out so much, or else he might have been dead already. Now, uh, Europe has to do better. Europe has to treat black athletes um, special. Uh, not necessarily more special than anybody else, but at least raise the standard of treatment uh, as it goes. Um, and so I, I think that um, Europe needs to show that they really care. And, and this seems to be a pattern because Mahila Jackson, when she was in Europe on a tour, she was sick here and her doctors had advised her not to go to Europe. Not for any other reason, but just for health reasons. And she ended up performing and felt bad and went to the backstage. And some little uh, brother came up, white brother came up and said, he's a doctor. And whereas he was no doctor and delayed um, her uh, medical attention. And so, you know, he put her in a bad way. And so, you know, I, I, and nothing was done to him. I mean, he should have been charged with, with murder or something. I mean, you're not a doctor, you're purporting to be a doctor, and here's this woman now depending on you and end up dead. So Europe has to do a lot better. And so, uh, Miss uh, Jean, uh, Pierre Adams, uh, my heart goes out to you. I wish you all the best, and I hope that uh, he maybe even recovers soon. Now, here's this other uh, brother here uh, playing, just went on, in the late stage of the game as a substitute and end up falling over and you could see this white brother here with his hand in his face he's kind of you know disturbed and um, athletes around but i believe in this case especially um, they should have had some cpr right away also they should have had some gizmo that could do the heart um, sort of defibrillation or whatever to give the heart a jump start because when an athlete uh, fall over like that. His ID is not breathing or he has a heart attack. I don't see any other reason why you would keel over. And they don't show as if they're sort of serious and to have, you know, right there medical help that could have intervened. Now, if they had done some CPR, it would have kept the body fresh and, you know, oxygen in the body, you know, so that when something else happens and, and, and more experts come in, they could have started from that and come on back. Um, and so I think a CPR and a heart jump start uh, would have helped this brother here so much. Um, this is this is bad for Europe, and uh, I hope that um, his family gets compensated, you know, adequately because this is gross negligence. They should have had some experts there at hand to do CPR and to do heart jump start. So Europe, you, you have your job cut out, man. Uh, I, I know also white athletes also probably uh, experience the same fate, fall over and, and poor preparation and end up dead. But, um, you know, this seems to be going to the to the high heavens, uh, you know, high hells or whatever, low hells. So Europe, do better for these athletes, okay?